Well, the snow can make life more difficult, but it's also crucial for Michigan's winter tourism season. The last few years have been a challenge, but the hope is that it's about to change. Here's 13 on your side, Lakeshore reporter John Mills. There's finally some good snow on the main snowmobile trail here in Muskegon County, and it's a good bet that this weekend the trail will be busy. The Hart Montague Trail takes riders right past the McCormick gas station. Sometimes it's nonstop. So when there's snow here, there are customers here. Here they come. <laughs> buying non-ethanol gas. They really like to use that in their sleds. And other supplies. Candy bars or oil for their snowmobiles, hand warmers. I think it'll be a great weekend. Bob Lukens with Visit Muskegon says now that winter weather is here, people are calling. They ask, uh, you know about snow conditions. It's snow that drives the county's winter tourism economy. We're a four season destination. Winter's a big part of our offerings here in Muskegon County. The thing that really makes it pop is snow. These riders not only spend money on gas, but also at area restaurants too. Up to Country Dairy for a burger and ice cream. This trio of riders hopes to put 2,000 miles on their sleds this year. Ride as much as we can. Hopefully this year will be a great year. It will take additional snow to hit that mark over at the Muskegon Luge Adventure Sports Park. Snowshoe trails are gorgeous with the sunshine like this. Bill Bailey and his crew are packing down all the snow that fell this week. We've got a ton of snow to work with, which is great this time of year because we can build a super strong ski base, super strong ice base on our rink. The snowshoe and ski trails are open. The luge track, which is the big draw, may open next weekend if it stays cold. And Muskegon County is also a big ice fishing destination, but so far this winter, the weather hasn't been good enough that is cold enough to realize the economic impact of that winter activity. In Muskegon County, John Mills, 13 on your side.